that he took that little effort to turn around and just give me a nod that I've never forgotten that for my whole rest of my life. And um, when we go in there, you'll see in the sloss that um, there's a big, a big foyer. And that foyer was where we used to have kirtans every Saturday night after we came back. And we used to have about eight madangas. <laughs> that was very far out. Actually, I, I can still play the madanga because when I lived in Hamburg, Hamsa did a scene that I had an attraction to for the madanga drum. And he would come and he would give out the madangas and he'd keep one for me. So actually, after all those years, I kept on playing madanga. Even sometimes the men would come and take it off me when I went to Australia. They didn't <laughs> like a lady playing in the dunga and they'd come and take it off me. But um, it took me a while to overcome that, but I kept with it and now I can play nice madanga. And I must say, she played madanga in our temple the other day or yesterday when this was, and I wanted to say, this is Prabhupada's beat. Yes. She plays the madanga like our ears are used to. Yeah. Prabhupada's beat, you know? Not some kind of fancy, <laughs> I don't know what, but really, and it does something to your heart. You know, it's just the same, it's the same, and on and on, and the meditation to Krishna is there. You know, no, no fancy mm. something, just thank you. That, that's true, actually. I noticed that a lot, that the way that the devotees mm. play Madanga these days, it's not really the way Shiva Prabhupada showed us. And we all learned how to play that beat that Shiva Prabhupada played us. And we play here and in this loss. And we all keep time. Eight, imagine eight madangas, right? All keeping time with the same beat. And I've never changed that beat. I always play that beat. And um, yeah, that's all about Prabhupada. Okay? telling us we shouldn't change anything. He, he gave us everything. Prabhupada gave us everything. I, in my life, I never received love from anyone like I did from Srila Prabhupada, even though I only got to see him six times in my life. But those memories of those small little things that he did to make me feel comfortable and, you know, he could feel when I was um, when I was afraid or, or you know couldn't read the Sanskrit. He would read it with me, and in the end, even though I couldn't do it, he said very good. <laughs> and when I got initiated by Shri Prabhupada, he told me he must have seen a little bit of fear in me, and he said, "Don't be afraid." If you follow this process, you go back home, back to Godhead at the end of your life. So, Prabhupada gave us everything. And he loved this castle, and he wanted it to be our German headquarters, but unfortunately it didn't happen. And uh, I wish it did, because it's really nice coming back here again. I was very, very happy when I read the um, program and that we will going to come here because this is a travel park here. Travel park. Yeah. 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 Yes, he is. He is back here. But um, this is the last place I lived in Germany before I went back to Australia in 1977. And this was the last place that I lived. And actually I, I didn't really want to go back to Australia. Harikesh sent the householders to different places and he said that we should go back to Australia because I was born there. But my Hare Krishna family was here in, first of all in Amsterdam and here in Germany. So I didn't really want to leave. I wanted to stay here with you all. But Krishna had his plan for me to go there. So this is the last place I was. So it's got a very strong memories for me. Cooking in the kitchen, 
remember when we had the, the fire sacrifice out here and, and all the devotees were getting initiated and Himavati had us in the kitchen, all us girls. And I said, oh, Himavati, can't we just go out there to the, to the sacrifice and, and see Srila Prabhupada? She goes, seeing Srila Prabhupada is serving Srila Prabhupada. But then some years later, I seen a video of the, of the initiation and there I was, I must have escaped the kitchen for one minute and I had my little head poking over the top in that film. <laughs> but uh, yeah, very special memories here. Gosh, dish with Papa and all of us. Thank you very much. Haribo! Wir werden...